Hi everyone, this is Alira Games, and today I'm watching episode 3 of Combatants Will Be Dispatched. Uh, last episode we saw the wheelchair lady be... a little smushed. <laughs> to understate it. Uh, but fortunately she can be revived. It is a little weird that nobody really cares too much about. I mean, it's still traumatic, and she still feels those deaths. So even the people on her team didn't seem to care. That kind of... That, that must sting a little bit. So having them, or seeing them have fun at the end there was pretty heartwarming. <laughs> Even though, I mean, it was both heartwarming and kind of hilarious because the way they were bonding was basically terrorizing everyone, and that was great. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's see what happens this episode. Sure, that had to do with the people. Yeah, <laughs> I'm glad he was listening in and just like decided to barge in at the right moment. He's Isekai Hitler. He's good at taunting. <laughs> really? This guy is just like... super tall. He's looking down on Isekai Hitler. Easily. This king looks like a little too cutesy for some reason. Ah, did they get command spells? <laughs> oh, that's a bruise. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's just it's a disease, isn't it? Oh, why isn't he dead yet then? <laughs> oh, right, okay. Yeah, no. <laughs> what is he what is he like? I don't I don't really remember him from the manga. Alright, here we go. Oh, I freaking love her. She is, yeah. Oh god, maybe if you cook it well. You could like... Does cooking mess with anything? <laughs> you can make some food and then like just don't tell her what it is. <laughs> no, don't bully Rose. Why does she have to eat it alive, though? She's been eating all the other stuff while they were dead. Oh, no. No, that's, ter that's a terrible idea. No, that would ruin her. Good. Good. 
He was a bit short, but other than that, everything else is, yeah, perfect. I, I, I really love heterochromia, so that's one aspect of her. De well, I pretty much love all aspects of her design. But that's one of the highlights. What what magic is that? I feel that Rose is going to be my favorite character, at least until, uh, uh, what's her name, Lilith, uh, ends up being a bigger part of the series. She means, or he means part of a different organization. So how old is she? I thought she was like 15 at least. Yeah, she's, she looks younger than you. She's not really explaining anything to, to her as to what that means. <laughs> oh no, don't reference that. Yeah, uh, I'm afraid of what the silicone would do. Wonder if there's a uh, dark magic to dark magic to make you flat. I feel there would be, because that's what, the, what her spells are kind of like. Since it's considered a negative, even though it's an amazing positive, she tries to make a lady flat. She gets flat in herself, and then she'd look amazing. Well, that's kind of because you're a jerk. <laughs> You have a terrible personality, buddy. Hopefully you change that a little bit. Maybe they know you're doing that and purposefully don't pass by there. Ah, yep, they found out. <laughs> nuh -uh, nope, nope. Doesn't count on her. Too young looking. <laughs> Does she think he was talking about her? Or is she just embarrassed about the, the concept of talking about girls in a sexy way? Ooh, who's this? Some sort of scientist lady. Uh, you know, I guess maybe researcher would be a better way to put it because there's no science here, really. Yeah, we have actually actual strategy now. I want to see this chosen one. I think I remember this part. Never mind on the uh, researcher lady. I uh, changed my mind about her. She has a nice face, though.
Well, <laughs> <laughs> That'll work. The smoke will rise until it takes up the entire tower, and they can only seal it up. You know. <laughs> They can only seal it up as much as they can before it starts leaking, and eventually they'll have to be smoked out. It's effective. It's reasonable. It's not like he's OP or anything. He actually would be more OP if he did more evil things, but, you know. At worst, his... His actions are scummy. At least she managed to get back. Okay, then. <laughs> that is a really weird way to sleep talk. I wanted to see where that was going. I wonder what that cross means in this world. Oh my god, where'd she get that? Is that a nail gun or some sort of SMG? Oh, maybe it's a grappling hook. No, it's a nail gun. That is interesting. I've never seen somebody climb something like this. Though I would be, like, terrified of one of those things coming loose. Well, she Rose has wings, right? <laughs> That's why it's not a bad view. Now her stamina is running out. Uh oh. Uh, they're all in single file, too, so she's not like she can stop. Couldn't you, like, oh, uh, couldn't you, like, throw her in one of the windows? Maybe she could fit through there. 
It'd, it'd be a better, safer bet than trying to make her climb. Or, okay, alright. I mean, it's not like... He does have pretty much... <laughs> oh, he's, he's taking the Araragi path here, except Araragi... Oh. Araragi's thing was a lot less legally questionable. I mean, it was a lot more legally questionable. Maybe not legally questionable. Legally, it would be alright, considering what she was. It'd be morally questionable. In appearance, anyway. There's a goat guy and a... <laughs> and a bull guy. It's always really funny when, like, characters get around these cliches. This kind of reminds me of that one part in One Punch Man where Genos just destroyed the base. You can probably let go now. Wow, he is really good at crawling. I guess he doesn't have any flying... Oh, okay, never mind. He's fine. He, he managed to grab on. <laughs> A good thing there's rocks up there. Oh, they're brothers. <laughs> That's hilarious. I feel we're seeing a pattern here. Seems like my eye is starting to act up again. Uh. Speaking of One Punch Man earlier, this also gives me vibes of that, you know, brother duo from the first episode. <laughs> boob woman. You are boobs. <laughs> well, good thing he's getting paid well. It's very effective and very life effective, you know? <laughs> uh, it seems his, uh, his organization is not 
compensating him effectively. So he doesn't even get paid? Okay, so he does get paid somewhat. And look, Lilith, oh, I can't wait to see her. She gets paid too. She doesn't need money, so it's more money for him. <laughs> I mean, it kind of was. That's kind of adorable. As unagreeable as Alice is, that's... Oh, God, this animation. All right, let's pause here. Uh, yeah, my eye is bothering me now, and I sometimes I don't record because it, it can be difficult to work with. But, um, yeah, this, this episode was enjoyable. Fun seeing those uh, little parts that you know, of him being a jerk to the enemy. That's one of the appeals of this show, that he's just a jerk. But it's directed towards the evil guys, to the point where you kind of feel bad for them. Uh, Konosuba has a little bit of that aspect as well. So you can see, you know, what they used and what worked with this that they ended up using in Konosuba. Uh, because I still feel, you know, Konosuba was probably their best work. And it has aspects of everything that they did before, but only the stuff that worked. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed my reaction to this. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.